I ain't losing my focus. I was going through pain, but I'm making it go. All these wounds on my body, I'ma cover and close. Like it's snow on the bluff, we just keeping it rolling. Everybody wanna know how I'm keeping it going. I don't think it is harder to know. I've been putting my vision in work. What's up, game man? We checking back in with another vloggy vlog, man. As y'all can tell from the TV on the back in the background, man, I am on daddy duties to the full, to the max right now. You feel me, y'all? Y'all know I gotta show y'all a little beginning of what we're doing right now. She's just so worried about Gabby's dollhouse, y'all. That's the only thing she's worried about. You feel me? We had a good night rest, good night sleep. She didn't even really pee in the bed last night for real, y'all. So give let's give it up for baby Kinsley in the comment section down below. Let's give her a round of applause. We getting there. We getting there. You feel me? But yeah, bro. Y'all can see, bro. She's watching TV right now. And yeah, bro. We just in here chilling, thugging, bro. I just seen Logan coming, came to the house. So I think he's in his room right now. But tell him, mama, what we on today? We on big daddy duties, huh? Big daddy duties. And I just love how, like, whenever you come around, come to the house, like, you just take, you take over everything. You know that, right? But, bro, get out the, ba <laughs> bro, get out the basket, bro. What is you doing? Like, bro, what is you doing? <laughs> All right, bro. Like, so let me know around what time you think I'm going to be able to get my, uh, my TV back. You know? You feel me? Like, I would love to watch some of the stuff I would want to watch. Cause like, so I'm just saying like every time you come over here, like when I say every time, I mean like every time you come over here, like you just got the TV all to yourself and like, you're not showing no sympathy or nothing. Like you just, you just hogging the TV. You don't, you don't care. You don't care about daddy. Okay. That, that's just how it works. Huh? That's just how the world gonna work. Huh? When you, you know, I love you and I care about you and I hope you feel the same. Yeah, I know you feel the same. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, man. Tell him we might, we might go to a little park today, huh? What, 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 what? We might go to a little park today and have a little fun. We might do something. Huh? Yeah, you love just walking out here. She love walking out here, y'all. It's like brightens up, brightens up her day for real, for real. What up, twin? How you feeling, man? Can you say what's up to my vlog? I'm tricking on TikTok right now. You tricking on TikTok? What up, YouTube? Hey, y'all. Uh, hey, what? what? I had to, I had to I had to shut your door when you was gone, bro. Cause you came in here and I seen stuff on the ground like this nice expensive camera, oh, yeah, yeah, real yeah, expensive. Yeah. You see what I, mean? so I had to shut that door. Ken, what you looking at? She probably looking at all these different colors and stuff right here. Ken, Ken. Yeah, in her own world. You want to come over and take over his TV? So daddy yeah. can daddy can get his TV back? Yeah. Yeah. Look, no. <laughs> no, she really looking at the TV too. Take her, it, take her. Is Kaya up? Yes, you're right oh, you thought you had me. I ain't gonna lie, you probably could have had me because, but your brother right here want to be a snitch. <laughs> you heard her going crazy, huh? Bro, you know she had to. She had. I know. Huh? She had to. She had to uh, come over here. She had to come over here, man, and lay with her again. I don't know, bro. She was going stupid crazy last night. Like, I don't know. It's okay though. We got through it though. Ain't that right, mama? We got through it. And we back in better the next day. Y'all can see, man. This is up early. To, well, it's not even early in the morning for real. Me and Kenzie been up since like 10 something. Got some good rest. Everybody is really in the midst of waking up. You know, oh, and I gotta go get her some more milk. Dang, that's what I really need to do. She didn't have the milk. I swear she Oh! <laughs> hey, they was the doctors and nothing. Hey, y'all was not lying. From my mama to everybody that had kids, but when they tell you, bro, that baby milk get expensive. That shit get expensive, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Like, she be running through that shit. But, uh, um, she, she said she ate pancakes or something the other day. Mm -hmm. She said she ate, uh, pancakes and mac and cheese. Okay. I said, I said, we getting somewhere. And we is checking back in, as y'all can tell, man. I just left the crib. I just left the store, really, because I had to run to the store and get some more milk for my daughter. You feel me? You know, nothing much. Just on daddy duties for real. Just a proud father, you know, doing this daddy shit. You feel me? Getting better with this shit each and every day because you cannot be the best dad in one day. Like, bro, like every day is a learning lesson. Like, you're going to learn stuff every day. Like, bro, you cannot be prepared. I feel like the, the thing, bro, they say having dogs and having pets and stuff can kind of prepare you to have a kid. But, bro, there's nothing like a human being. I'm sorry. Like, you can have your dog. You can feed them and let them go loose. You feel me? Like, like Cash, for example, bro. You make sure Cash got his food on the ground and you let him out every now and then to go use the restroom. You do not have to worry about him. For, that's it. You don't got to worry about him at all. But when it comes to a human being, bro, it's something every single day. You feel me? They're, they're, your child is going to change every single day. 
or every single week they're going to go through different emotions different stuff so nothing in this world can prepare you to, to raise another human being y'all so with that being said we getting better with this each and every day you feel me we learn this stuff i'm learning you're gonna I'm, I'm learning more about my daughter and, and if you do have kids and if, whenever you do have kids bro you're gonna learn more stuff about your your child each and every day you know what they like what they don't like and all that good stuff man but yeah, bro, I'm just, I mean, I'm just in a good mood right now. I ain't gonna lie y'all. I got my daughter at the crib. You feel me? Got my baby at the crib waiting on me with the gang. But yeah, bro, I had to make a quick run to the store real quick, y'all, because my baby is running out of milk. And when they said that milk was gonna be another bill, boy, they wasn't lying. They wasn't lying at all, man. They wasn't lying. But yeah, bro, my baby be eating through, the, uh, going through that milk so fast. And I got her these little her little snacks, her favorite snacks, bro. So when I get back to the crib, I'm gonna show her them them snacks, and she gonna go crazy. You feel me, y'all? But man, I hope y'all doing good. I hope y'all having a blessed day, man. I hope y'all getting y'all work done. I hope y'all on, on y'all shit, man. Standing on y'all on y'all business and, and, and handling whatever y'all need to handle. I got some cool shorts on right now, y'all. It's like 70, 80 degrees outside in Houston. You feel me, y'all? I really think, I really do think the. Oh yeah, I think uh, winter is officially over because I checked the weather. It said nothing but 70 some degrees and like another week or two, it's about to be March. Damn, winter is officially over, I feel like. Like these last couple of days, these last couple of days, y'all, was being like, was cold. Like it dropped to like 40 something at, at night, like 40 degrees, damn near 30. But then I just checked the weather, say like it's 70 degrees, y'all. So man, the winter is over with, man. I, I, I'm thinking, I'm guessing, right? Because it's not going to get cold in March. Dang, so all my jumpsuits and stuff, man. I gotta, I gotta hang them up, y'all. I gotta hang them up. You feel me? Y'all know last summer I was, y'all called me the white tee dope boy. You feel me? I love these white tees, bro. That's because in Houston it gets so hot, bro. Like nine times out of ten, bro. Like in the summertime again, bro. I don't feel like putting on the whole fit, y'all. I swear. And then I don't like wearing black and during the day, boy. Houston, bro. Last summer was crazy. I already know this summer gonna be crazy. So. Um, expect the white tees again, especially when I'm not doing shit for real, y'all. I'm gonna throw on this white tee, y'all, and that, I'm gonna call it a day. You feel me? Every single day. Don't get me wrong. I do like to get put that drip on, put that shit on, y'all. But every single day, y'all. Uh, man, I don't know. I don't know, y'all. Be too hot. But I'm on the way to the crib right now. Kaya is watching Baby Kenzie for me, and she did tell me to hurry up, y'all. So I gotta get to the crib, oh. You feel me? And I'm gonna see y'all when I get there. All right, gang. <clears throat> All right, gang. I just got back to the house. And as y'all can tell from the title of this video, man. Well, this is my intro, y'all. This is my intro to the video because it wouldn't make no sense to do the intro in the beginning because I opened it up with a vlog. But as you can tell, bro, I'm on daddy duties. I got my baby right here with me. She's taking over the TV in the room per usual. You feel me? But we're going to get to the chase, man. We're going to cut to the chase. Oh, my bad. My bad. She's not playing by her uh, crackers, y'all. Here you go, baby. She love these. She love them. So... It says, oh yeah, from the top of the video, man, I'm going to be leaving baby Kinsley with the gang with a goodbye letter. You know, last time, not last time, well, I think like two or three months ago, or was it not three months ago, like two months ago, I think I did leaving baby Kinsley home alone with the gang, you feel me, like home alone pray, and these niggas really thought I was going to leave my baby home alone, no, so this time it's going to be kind of similar, but not because I'm leaving them with baby Kenzie with a goodbye letter basically saying hey y'all gotta take over for me you feel me so we're gonna hop into this so this is what i'm gonna read my letter y'all and then we're gonna hop into the video so my 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 letter says hello everyone y'all are probably wondering what this is and why baby Kenzie is here by herself i understand last time was all fun and games when i left her here home alone and it was a prank but no this time it's serious i can't do this anymore i haven't told her mom yet i don't know if i should it's a lot of stuff that goes on in my head that I can't put into words. I'm leaving her with y'all because I feel like y'all are the perfect fit. Jazz, you have a dog, so I know you have a little bit of patience. And you're good with kids. Okay, okay, mama. Okay, here. My bad. My bad. You're going to just... There we go. There you go. Here, get your big one. There you go. I love you. So back to it. It says, Kaya, you handle her well, so I know you won't have a problem. And I know you wasn't planning on having a baby soon, but here you go. It says rod and loaded. Just be the store runner for her milk and stuff. I know y'all can't do shit else. J Long, the cook, the master. I know you will have her belly full and protected. Amar, just be you and make her laugh. But yeah, man, I can't do this no more. Too much on my mental. Well, I hope you read this with love and joy. This morning was y'all last time seeing me. So, y'all, 
in a little bit, bruh, I'm gonna go put her in there. I'm gonna strap her down and everything. I'm gonna strap her down and I'm gonna leave this note in there. You feel me? And I'm gonna just, I gotta catch somebody walking out, y'all. So stay tuned for this video, man. It's gonna be a good one. It's gonna be a hype one. Leave a comment in the comment section down below. Give this video a thumbs up. I love y'all, gang, and we're gonna tune in. Stop, I told! 
Oh, that's that good car seat too. Bro, that's my bad toe though. Mm -hmm. What we gonna do? I say call the police. Bro, she got an old mama, so we got police don't call CPS. Yeah, okay, right, right, right. We don't want the baby to get took. Call Sierra. 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 We'll be wrong. We'll be wrong. We'll be wrong. And then you really trying to be a good parent. Jordan is a a a unfit parent that is not able to take care of. Bro, this man left us. He ain't doing no diapers. Where's the extra milk? I ain't paying for. I ain't putting the milk. I don't want to talk about them. That's probably why they the store runners. They gotta go get the shit. So nigga, we gotta we gotta we gotta fix this. Uh uh. He gotta be done with YouTube. Who did that? Y'all not talking about him? No, that's not mine. Oh, oh, he must be done with YouTube. He must just be like, what he turned into like a, a, dope, a dope runner or something? I got it. That's all I'm saying. She should have been. I tried to call him. He's not in the same phone. Maybe I should try. Maybe that bro. Maybe, yeah, yeah. Maybe if he see loaded name come across the screen, he'll get some comments in the screen. I'm really I'm gonna leave the crazy ass voicemail. You got a voicemail on your phone? Oh, yeah. So I made something? No, no. Do a voicemail. I'm gonna leave a voicemail being answered. Maybe he needs to hear this shit like by himself or something. Maybe I wanna respond. But that's a dead shit, bro. Nah, that's a poet. I can't, I can't even be around a nigga who don't want to take care of that children, bro. I don't respect that shit at all. If you lay down, you had that baby. You need to take care of that child, bro. This reminds me of Uncle Lucas. Uncle Lucas did some bitch ass shit like this. No, that's a bitch ass shit, bro. No, we did. We got voicemails. We put Uncle Lucas in jail too. Okay. Baby with us. Hold on, hold on. That's a crime. You bitch ass nigga. You sat here and left this baby here, bro. And I read this little weak ass letter, bro. This shit is weak as hell. You want to be a man? Grandma. Yo, poor ass grandma. Fuck the grandma. You left this baby here, man. You sat down and you had sex and you made that baby, bro. Be a motherfucking man. Drop your nuts and take care of your child, bro. What you mean talking about? I hope you read this with love and joy. Ain't no love and joy in leaving your child, nigga. I can't read you it anyway without these run-on sentences. You on some fuckboy shit, nigga. And I don't know what you mean, nigga, because I got a dog and a girl and a child. A dog and a child is two different goddamn things. My dog don't even need as much attention. You need to love and cradle and show your baby that, man, you was a hoe, nigga. Every motherfucking girl need a daddy and you was a hoe. You gonna leave this baby here talking about me? I'm calling Sierra. I'm calling Sierra, nigga. And you didn't leave no diapers. Uh, bitch ass nigga. Bitch ass nigga. Hope you hear my motherfucking voicemail for that shit. That's a weak ass shit, man. We call oh. Sierra right now, Oh, God. Hey, how y'all Sierra? I'm oh, call Sierra. Call Sierra. Oh, God. Call Sierra. Call Sierra, bro. I just I don't, don't like understand how you can put two periods in this whole thing. I'm not calling the goddamn police for this baby, bro. This shit's fucked up. She don't even know. Look at the pretty baby. Last resort. Last resort. Jordan needs consequences. Peekaboo. Shut up. Who did this? Who did this? Who did this? Chocolate man. 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 Well, just shoot a text first time. I don't even want to stress the area out right now. What? This is what you mean? This, nah. this is this is why you want to call. But I'm just saying, Kyle, you want to you want to stress her out, bro? She left her child with her baby daddy, thinking the baby daddy, and this nigga leaves her. No, you gotta think about it, Kyle. What, what we call, we called you? And he, oh, that's just a lot to process. I ain't gonna lie to you. I just text. That's a lot to process. Like no cap. What are you gonna do? I gotta get my head done today. I got shit to do
They say it take a village. I used to my grandma say that. We the village, y'all. We the village. At this point, we the village. But what about what about right now? So if he come back, don't sound like that nigga is ever coming. I'm putting my hours in right now. Man, so we're gonna play that nigga room. I think we turn that nigga room to a studio. Cause I can't get right on bitch ass. So 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 you see his ass. A screen room. I put my. That's what I'm saying. They're not like a whole screen room, bro. So I can't really do it in like. Oh God, I can't be fuck, I can't fuck with no, no whole ass nigga who wanna sit here and lay down and make cheering and don't shit down his head. You're not gonna be around me, nigga. You're not gonna be no dead beat ass nigga around me, nigga. I don't need condoning that shit. Cause I got a daddy. And I love having a daddy. Can we rename the baby? Huh? Can we rename the baby? Rename the baby? I mean, Tony, hey, y'all, you used to kids. Caleb. Yeah, she doesn't have to kids. Yeah, yeah, you can't rename baby at what's your two? That's, that's too long. They meant to call her kid kid and kids and forgot their family. Hey man, how y'all doing? Man, ah! <laughs> hey, listen, listen. The whole time I'm listening to y'all, to everything y'all saying, I'm like, bro, I can't take this no more. Y'all really think I'm gonna leave my baby? I know it hurts to be called a baby. Huh? It hurts to be called a failure. You said he went to UPS, FedEx, and printed out all this shit and typed it. Oh yeah, what y'all think about that letter? Brother, you would be a great store runner. I'm telling you. You would be a horrible. This Book all, writer. All this is well, from, from, from my thoughts, nigga, I had an 88. I averaged an 88 in uh, English. Hey, my, hey, my beautiful baby. Hey, you, you know I wasn't gonna look, leave you, right? We talked about this earlier. No, we, 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 we talked about this earlier, y'all. Hold on. So what's up? The, brother, you ain't even giving enough time. I, be, I just put it there. But but if I was but I'm saying if I was gone, you was gonna have to put her in your Come schedule, twin. Come here, mama. Twin, bro. <laughs> hey, Jazz say she ain't having no kids afternoon. right now. I was gonna take the afternoon, but I got told my nigga my night. My nah, for sure. I feel that. Who who called out the night side? Did anybody call that night? I'm gonna be the host. Yeah, okay. We gonna we gonna I'm gonna put you through some training. None of that shit that you was doing, my boy. Boy, you crazy? That was wrong. You really think I'm gonna leave my baby here with a goodbye lady? A bad ass. Hey, but if even. No. No, no, no. No, 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 no. They can do that. They're, I said they're store runners. So whatever y'all you need them to do, they can go get for her. Oh, okay, but runner. driving her to the appointment and stuff, no. he drive kind of crazy. I don't, not yet. Not yet. No, not yet. For one, don't make At a all. letter and put me in it. No, no brother, you're a store runner. Everybody was going to have a job. No. But, look, though, organized crime. look, though, y'all, man. Y'all crazy if y'all think I'm going to just leave my baby with a goodbye letter. Never. Ever, ever in this world will I do that. But, man, I had to see what the gang gonna do. I had to see their reaction, man. And I ain't gonna lie, bro. These niggas is funny, y'all. I had to come out, bro, because I couldn't I couldn't go no longer, y'all. So I'm gonna need y'all to hit that subscribe button. Follow me on all social media, y'all, so y'all can stay up to date with everything that's going on. And we out. I ain't even know who, but they ain't rhyme for me. I ain't even got lock and they keep trying to clone me. If it ain't about racks, all that postpone. And it's crazy, I see it, I'm good on my lonely. And it's crazy, I see it, I'm good on my lonely.